Here's 100 times road ragers got instant karma. This driver thinks that he's having a bad day, but he didn't expect the other driver to confront him. I'm sorry, what? The fire extinguisher was random enough, but this other dude pulled out a whole car seat. I know plenty of people who would be even more upset if someone didn't react to them. I kinda like this guy. This guy was so upset with the other driver that he decided to take an emergency exit to make sure he kept up with them. The look of defeat on this guy's face when he broke his own mirror was priceless. Imagine being so fed up with traffic and other drivers that you chuck your hot dog bun at them. This guy definitely isn't happy about being pulled over, but he's even more upset about the pepper spray. If you're about to get out of your car in the middle of traffic, make sure you put it in park. This dude picked the wrong intersection to pull a bit of road rage out. This dude was so upset with the other driver that he held up a whole line of traffic to give him a piece of his mind. Why do I feel like this is a person I don't want to mess with? He's got the gloves and everything. This guy never expected his own maneuver to backfire on him, but there he goes. This guy was talking a lot of heat, but he knew that once his buddy lost control, he had no ground to stand on anymore. I don't think anyone drunk and shirtless really has a chance against a car. I have a good feeling that this taxi driver has a lot of other problems going on. Another idiot who doesn't understand how their gears in the car work.
This is why you should keep all your fingers on the wheel. That one finger wasn't worth all of this. That's one way to stop the bickering. Clearly these people have places to go and they don't have any time for this crap. This truck driver thought that he could bully this other driver. He didn't realize that there was a police checkpoint further down the road, though. This guy kept stopping in front of them, and this other guy had uh, just about enough of it. This idiot really tried to road rage on slippery, icy roads, and they found out that they can't drive like they normally do. You have a stop sign. You see the fool all the way in the left lane? Apparently, they wanted to turn right, so the left lane definitely made sense. This guy really has a problem with cyclists, but apparently, he hasn't run on his own two feet in quite some time. Our driver was lucky enough to be a spectator to some interesting road rage. Have you ever seen someone road rage with a little bit of laughing gas? Well, there you go. This apparently happens way more times than I ever thought it did. In fact, I didn't think too many people were stupid enough for this to happen. This is a screw up on two levels. This dude lost his car and picked a fight with an undercover cop. He really tried to be intimidating, but it doesn't work when you can't hold on to your intimidation stick. Even if you pull these protesters off the road, they manage to crawl back slowly. Crazy. This woman quickly realizes that her phone isn't going to take this a good enough picture, insane. so she decides to become a sketch lady, artist lady, instead. Please move your car. <laughs> please move your car. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> hey, so I 
wonder what she's writing down. She is still here. This car thought that it was big enough to play with the big boys, but they quickly found out that it wasn't the case. This woman was really getting upset that the bus almost hit her, even though she's clearly parked in the bus lane. They must have thought that they had a bionic leg or something. Just a little more patience and this driver would have never had to find out that this was an undercover cop. Just stay in your car unless you're parking. Even the car didn't like this stop. It's bad when the passing traffic slows down enough just to tell you how stupid you're being. You guys are stupid. You're gonna get arrested. Get in your car, you idiots. Both of you. Retard. This dude really pull out a belt for some old school disciplining. He ended up going back to his car with a nice face tan and weepy eyes. I don't know why he was trying to block the truck, but it didn't work. This isn't your typical road rage. Usually, you rage at other drivers, not the kids on your school bus. Generally speaking, you're not supposed to kick things at police or their cars either. That cop hustled out. Why do so many people think that their bodies are enough to stop drivers? This fool really tried to fight with a golf club, but a nice little splash embarrassed him enough. <laughs> the middle of the on-ramp is not the place for you, bro. Okay, this guy really doesn't want to deal with her because he's going the speed limit and no slower. This fool had been tailgating for quite a while, but then they decided that a little vehicular warfare sounds pretty good. This driver doesn't have time for protesters, and these guys look absolutely defeated when they go back to their lane. These protesters are really getting upset that someone had to get on their way. 
This guy ended up in the wrong lane, and he decided to throw down when he got called out for it. This fool thought speeding and brake checking was cool, but he probably would have been better off hanging out beside this driver. What's your problem? What is your problem? This fool thought he could take on a bunch of guys from in his car. His car ended up being a trap for the bear mace. Listen to the sound of my people as they go back and forth until the thud. This guy tried to keep going with his insult, but it just wasn't hitting the same way. No, I'm good. See, because you know you lose. How do I leave? Because I will beat your dick into the ground all day long. That's kind of gay, isn't it? I will beat your dick. <laughs> this red car tried to pick a fight with a semi, and they quickly realized that this was poor decision making. This little white Volkswagen really said nope and went for broke here. Jeez, oh my god! <gasps> I feel so unprepared for not having Mace in my car with me. Watching these makes me think that I need to spray everything with it. What is that, an umbrella? Either way, the bigger guy escorted him back to his car. All he had to do was get in his car and pull over. But nope, one person too many told him to do that apparently. This is so funny, oh my god. Idiots in cars. Oh yeah, all right. Let's go, right here. This guy doesn't care about I'm your feelings. Sorry, he your needs his food now. Are brother and sister, oh, and you're a fat sack of inbred shit. Now move, idiot. <laughs> oh my. Oh. Oh my God. Who gets the shit? Move, oh. idiot. Oh my God. This guy clearly isn't having a good day but he was probably better off ignoring the camera. <laughs> this guy was trying to road rage, but this trucker decided to stop him before he could really start.
This guy in the truck was causing all sorts of problems, so naturally, he got maced since this is a common occurrence. Do you want to hear the most Canadian road rage you? ever, eh? Buddy, there's rocks on that side. Oh. Okay. Just move the car. It's not okay, that hard. I, I will. Okay, I will. I, I didn't realize the cars were behind That's me. It's all good, man. It's all good. Holy fuck. If you can't get through there, you shouldn't be driving. My truck's worth more than your car. I'm not going to risk scratching on some fucking rocks. You hear me? Just look at all the parking spots, bud. Go for it. Come on. Get out. What's the best defense against tire slashers? Pepper spray, of course. Don't you love how both dudes just assume the stance of all dudes trying to act big, bad, and tough? Hey, I'm not in your face, man. Get back here, motherfucker. Give me yours. Go ahead. You guys either fight or move out of the way. Try to knock me out, motherfucker. Get in your motherfucker's car. I don't listen. Get in your car. Get in the car. You're not my boss. That's in your best interest. It's in your best interest to get in your car. Get in your car and move. Get in your car and move. That's right. Get back in your car. Get in your car and go. Meanwhile, in Florida, everybody is just whizzing around each other. At another end of the country, Philly can't seem to stop running stop signs. What are you supposed to do? Yeah, the foot traffic, you idiot! Yeah, she stopped, she went to the stop sign, so I just hit the side of her car, like, hey, I didn't slap, I didn't punch it or anything. Got you on camera, you idiot. These are the ones where it gets a little concerning. This is a quiet back road, and this witness is a mile away. This was a satisfying karma moment. This guy really didn't want to be filmed, but I bet that he really, really didn't want to get maced. On his mother, he just maced him. Oh, shit. Oh, he maced him. He maced him. Oh. Oh, he maced him. My mother, he just maced him. Look at those reflexes. These protesters just keep popping up and blocking traffic. At least you know that they don't have anywhere to be right now. This is my favorite clip. What's up? Poor dude wasn't even in the front seats. What, you don't see where you're fing going? I wasn't even driving. Oh, shut the f up, you f piece of bacon. <laughs> Why did I get picked up? <laughs> Hear what you said. You can't do said, that anymore. So this poor dude oh, knew that he was know, better I'm off being nice here. I just came out to my parent. I just came out to my parents. I came out to my parents that I'm gay. I don't know how to tell my parents that I'm gay. I just came out to my parents. I'm I, I'm I like I'm bisexual. I don't know what to do anymore. <sighs> nope, nothing to see here, officer. This truck speeds off after a close call, but this biker isn't letting him get away.
Oh my god, she almost got in! I don't know how people drive in New York. This is just anxiety all over the place. This fool really wanted to beep at this biker, but the biker <laughs> ended up all right and in front. They're right, you can't be wrong and aggressive. Now you look even more stupid than before. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, but if you want to watch more, just click the one on the screen.